Right now, the state is deciding whether or not to start moving into phase two of reopening this week. CBS 17 digital data reporter Jody McCreary digging deeper into the numbers behind that decision and finding out how we compare with other states. When it comes to opening back up, some other states are further along than North Carolina is. But how do our numbers compare to theirs? A team of researchers is doing the math for every state, and they say North Carolina might not be ready yet. The website COVIDExitStrategy.org is run by researchers from across the country, including one from Duke. They boil the numbers down into a system with the three colors of a traffic light, based on whether a state is meeting standards set by the White House. North Carolina is one of 19 states that was colored red today. The main knock on our state? The 14-day trend of COVID cases. That continues to rise. They also say we're making progress in testing, but still need to do twice as many of them as we're doing now. I spoke to another expert, Pia McDonald of RTI International, and she's also concerned that the number of COVID-19 cases continues to climb. Is the number of cases growing on average every day, or is it are they stable or decreasing every day? And in North Carolina, it's worrisome to me because the number of cases are on average growing. 15 of those red colored states are listed as already having started reopening and one of them is South Carolina. But there's one big difference in the numbers between the two Carolinas. We'll explain at CBS17.com.